Hey Lars, well, it's been a month since our last check-in, so we've got a whole month of side-by-side -side progress to try and get through. Let's move quick. In Shanghai, the Northwest Extension has gone from a shell to pretty much done. Just north of that is a utility building extension, which a month ago was just sticks, frames if you will. It is getting closed off and it's looking good. That building in the north central area, it is now complete. Big news in Shanghai is the cooling towers in the southwest corner are back up to full speed, indicating high production. In Berlin, the stamping extension to the north is kind of moving along, though very slowly. In the south, the parking rework has been coming along, the parking lot looks great, and they've started adding more murals to the southern face of the building. The drainage area has gotten landscaping, the retention basin if you will, and the 4680 building is getting so pretty. Just about closing off, I'd say, still thinking we may see production by the end of the year, and the loading lot in the northeast is getting paved and kinda done and ready for use. In Texas, the west entrance is done, and in the southeast, they've started adding new loading docks. Kinda didn't have enough. In the southwest corner, there's new superchargers for newly made Model Ys, and on that southwest corner, up the side a little bit, more loading docks have been cut in, because again, they just need them. The main parking lot has gotten done. There's a new loading area over there that may become the logistics lot for outbound vehicles. And to the south of it, there's new asphalt, more pavement, more parking, and a helicopter pad. Why not? That big pile of dirt we were watching in the south is now a small pile of dirt as they're regrading around the site. The cathode building, well, it got its frame, it got its roof, and it's got a lot of its floors, and they've even started interior work with some plumbing and utilities and other such things. The switchyard, or substation, well, they got their approval, so they put in their drains, and they've started foundations where the transformers will go. It's moving forward. The roof solar looks a little different, but for a month I'm kind of surprised. There's going to be 70,000 panels up here, and we're only at about 20,000 so it's gonna be a little while. If you want these more regularly, I do them weekly on my channel, but this is a special one. This is a whole month in review. Thank you, Slappers, for being here. Back to you, Lars.